Welcome back to my kitchen. If you are new here, my name is Christine. Today I want to show you how to make the very best oven baked ribs and a really great rib rub recipe. Before I get started, the first thing I do is rinse off my racks of ribs in really cold water and just get them nice and clean. And then I make sure that I pat them dry. And that is key. You really want to make sure that they are really, really dry and that you get all the moisture up off of them, as you can see I'm doing here. After that, I take the membrane off the back of the racks of ribs, and it's really simple. As you can see here, you just need to get it started, and then it comes right off. For this part, I just use equal parts, a quarter cup of red wine vinegar, a quarter cup of oil, and then about a tablespoon of Maggi. I whisked it all together to get it well emulsified. And I'm just going to rub the ribs with this mixture before I put the actual rib rub on. You could skip this step. This isn't like mandatory. This is just kind of my way of doing it. I just feel like it's an extra step for flavor and tenderizing the ribs nicely. And then it provides a nice sticking agent. Some people use mustard, but you could use nothing at all. And I feel like the rub would still stick fine. Okay. I didn't use all of it, FYI. Now here comes the best part of this recipe. It is the rub that is just so outstanding. To a bowl, add paprika, brown sugar, kosher salt, black pepper, ground cumin, mustard powder, onion powder, garlic powder, and a little bit of cayenne pepper. Get that all really well combined. I'm telling you, this rub is the key. Okay, these have been sitting for about 20 minutes. If I had more time, I would let them sit for maybe half an hour. But if you don't have any time at all, just go straight to the rib rub, that's okay. Now I'm going to take the rub that we made earlier and just start getting all the pieces generously coated on both sides. I've got my ribs tightly covered. I am just going to pop these into a 300 degree oven for about three and a half to four hours and we will be back. At the end, I brushed on some of our favorite barbecue sauce and my friends, these turned out so, so delicious. I think this is my new favorite oven baked ribs recipe. Highly recommend it. I just want to say thanks for joining me in my kitchen today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I can pop another video right here for you to check out between now and my next upload. Please subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up. I upload every other day and I can't wait to see you next time.